in the movie business these days. Uh, she is the star of the controversial hit thriller, Basic Instinct. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome back to the program, Sharon Stone. <laughs> Great. You were here on this program once before, weren't you? Mm -hmm. How long ago was that? It's been probably about two years. Two years Total ago. Total Recall. Total Recall. And in those days, you were a movie star. <laughs> you, were, you were an actress who made films and you were a movie star. But now, you're like a blockbuster. You're a megastar. You're a, you're a big deal. You're suddenly, you're just like a skyrocket. <laughs> Pretty weird. Yeah. yeah. Any trouble adjusting to that? Yeah, it's sort of weird. I mean, you know, Friday, I was this actress who... Yeah, it was okay. I could get maybe get a job. Yeah. Monday it was like walking down the street. We go, Sharon Stone. I go, what? <laughs> People startled you, didn't they? They scare me a little because yeah, yeah. they yell my name, and then I don't know. Do I know you? Mm -hmm. Should I know you? Did we go to school together? Are you my cousin? Yeah. Are you a killer? <laughs> <laughs> now, is it uh, people, I guess, no, this is not a dumb question. Obviously, people are recognizing you from this film because it's your most recent work. Yeah. Now, does that pose any problems? Do they think that you're, you're goofy, that you're nuts, that you're, you're dangerous, that you're a, a psycho killer yourself? Everybody calls me Miss Stone. Uh -huh. <laughs> they go like this, Miss Stone, uh -huh. hi. So they're very nice to you then, yeah. they're treating you with respect. They're a little scared. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, what, what was it like making this film? It was fun. It was a long shoot. We shot five months in San Francisco and mm -hmm. Carmel and LA. What about that Michael Douglas guy? How's he? <laughs> He's pretty good. Yeah. Pretty good guy. Did you get along all right with him? Yeah, I did. I mean, we read a lot of stuff in the paper. Well, I read a lot of stuff in the paper every day now about this other life i never known. You, you find that, that there are reports of your activities in newspapers <laughs> that are not necessarily based in reality. Yeah, I, I saw one the other day that said that this, um, this actor had come up to me in a club and given me his phone number and I'd ripped it up, thrown it on the ground and said, I'm out of your league, cowboy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And that really hurt my feelings. <laughs> so I, I phoned it right in. But that didn't happen. No. Yeah, but it's a good story. It's I like that you're out of my league, cowboy. cowboy. That's an excellent <laughs> touch. Uh, and uh, when you made it, uh, now people are saying that there's a lot of uh, exciting uh, sexually explicit material that did not make it into the final cut of the film. Is that true? Is there a lot of really good stuff someplace? <laughs> I, I don't mean that what's in the film is not really good, but you, you know what I'm saying. Yeah. Is there uh, other things uh, floating around? Yeah. yeah. And was it difficult to do that kind of work uh, on a sound stage in, fr in front of... Uh, you know, technicians and guys walking well, around drinking Diet Pepsi. And <laughs> <laughs> well, the crew is really lovely group of people. Of course they were. <laughs> I'd be lovely too if I was in on that. <laughs> if, I thought, if I thought that's where I'm going to work today, oh, I'd be a prince. <laughs> <laughs> I read in another one of these rags that it was so steamy oh. that it turned into a 400-person orgy, but Miss Stone was so worked up she had to go to her trailer. <laughs> I'm like, how come I like get worked up and go to my trailer? Right. Now, I, I think, I think, yeah, they, they, asked, they asked you to leave. Yeah, you yeah. have to go now. Uh, but now, I, I mean, I understand how people uh, would, would fantasize about that kind of thing, and they would exaggerate just to sell uh, magazines and newspapers and so forth. On the other hand, if you think about it, what must have been involved seems very awkward and, and perhaps uncomfortable. Oh, it's to, incredibly to dumb. Yeah. It's just dumb. I mean, you do, you do love scenes, and... You know, you, you're so close, you have to keep moving so that you're, the camera can see you and, and you have everything orchestrated and everybody moves mm -hmm. all together and the technicians are there. And, and then, of course, because you've got your director going, okay, roll over now, turn now, lean up now, kiss now, this. So you have to go back in and do the sound later. Yeah. So you're standing alone in this room with a microphone in the dark watching this black and white, grainy, messed up print of the film going by and you're going, ah, oh, 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 oh yes, yes. <laughs> then they go, my mom to one of those looping sessions so that she would know that it was so benign. Mm -hmm. She's like sitting there going. <laughs> now you, you didn't talk mom into helping out, did you? <laughs> um, let's, let's take a look at a clip of this film. Do you want okay, to? Okay, yeah. Man, I can't, you know, I was stunned there for a moment uh, with the, the sound effects. <laughs> yeah. 
So that's what it's like, huh? I'll be darned. Um, hey, she's here now. Stop it. Uh, do you know what we're going to look at? I think we're going to see a piece of the interrogation sequence mm -hmm. where I play a murder suspect. Michael's brought me in for questioning. He's the police detective on the case. And these are five somewhat lascivious guys that I'm toying with. You, you have sort of captured them in, in uh, a manner of speaking. Here we go, Sharon Stone. <laughs> That's, it's very exciting, very provocative, very, uh, you know, it's got a nice sort of gritty, edgy feel to it. I there. don't know. Every yeah. time I see it, it gets funnier to me. Really? Yeah, it's I like... get going like, and then what? Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> well, you do it very nicely, though. And you have, you have lovely, lovely legs. Why, thanks, yeah. Dave. I heard you were kind of a leg yeah, man. Well, it's part of my job to call attention to the obvious every now and then. <laughs> Uh, and you're going to be the uh, the big host of Saturday Night Live. How are things yeah, going up there? Tomorrow night. Yeah. Oh, great! Mm -hmm. It's such a blast. A lot of funny things happening on the show. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you know, you go to the read through where everyone comes in with their ideas for scenes. Yeah. I would say about in 97 percent of the ideas, I wasn't wearing any. <laughs> <laughs> you kind of have to give them that, you know. Yeah. Yeah. I can you understand darn that. jokesters, yeah. you. <laughs> uh, well, congratulations on, on the big uh, blockbuster film, and have a lovely time tomorrow night. Good to Thank see you, you again. It's uh, Sharon Stone. Kids, we'll be right back with John Doe.